Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining how you can change your password for your locked folder in Google Photos. So let's get right into it. Now, if you want, you can check out my other tutorials and how you can set up this locked folder. And there I plainly explain what the password for accessing this locked folder is. But I'll be focusing more on this uh, that in this video and I'll be going over this article just to explain some of the beginning steps. So let's get right into it. Now, uh, want to, if you want to access your uh, locked folder, you need to go, if you're on mobile, you go into library, utilities and locked folder. If you're on a computer, on the left hand uh, sidebar, you will see a locked folder icon and you just click on that. Now to access that folder, you do need a password and in the case of mobile apps, uh, it is the same as your uh, unlock password for your device so if you're using android or ios it could be your fingerprint it could be your face it could be a numerical or uh text textual code it could be a pattern and that is pretty much what you need to access it now to change it for google photos uh, google photos inherits that from your device so you need to go into your device and set up a different uh login method or uh, unlock method and once you do that uh, it'll automatically transfer to the locked folder as well and it's as simple as that for uh, mobile devices except for mobile devices uh, you need either android version 6 or later or ios 15 and later to actually access the locked folder now on computer it is a bit different it is just your password for your account so whichever google account you've used to create that locked folder that uh, password will be inherited and you'll need to use it to actually access the folder and of course to change that password uh, you'll need to ch change the password of your account and that is pretty much it i have uh, made a tutorial in the past on how you can actually change the password and that is pretty much it hope you guys enjoyed and i'll be seeing you guys in another video